hi everyone in this video I'm going to show you how to add power ups how to do automations and also how to use the filter okay so let's go so firstly the workspace we are uh, we are using let us go ahead and take the workspace we are using the me and you workspace which was created in the first video yesterday and we are using the board emi local okay so we're using the board emi local okay so the board you created okay so now let's go ahead to power ops this is power ops up here so now look at before we start the, using the power ops let's go into this fine boy card the card fine boy has no power ops you can see here on the actions we have just move copy make templates archive and share only we have now let us go and go ahead and add power ops now we we'll add power ops here so power add power ops okay then it begins to load okay it loads so we when it loads we're going to see that we have um, several power ops here you can see it has loaded so we have several power ops we also have power ops made by trello power ops made by by trello so let's you can see power ops made by trello there are many of them okay many of them okay zendex voting okay let us use voting let's add voting let's try voting voting add it has been added and let us go to our cards I'm going to see voting in our cards. No, this is fine boy. Let's go into fine boy again. Okay, so fine boy. Now let us go down to actions. Actions. Can you see vote has come in into fine boy? Vote has come in. You understand? So that is part of voting. Now when I click on voting, you can see vote has come up there. If I take it off, it goes off. If I click it, it comes. So one can vote and also on votes okay so like when they have when you have um you have several cards and you have several checklists so now members of the board decides that okay well, let us vote for the, the card that actually fits into what we want to use it for so after everything they vote and then the one that has the highest vote, vote the card that has the highest vote will then be chosen um, to be used for what probably you want to use it for then it goes to the next stage okay that's the essence of the voting and and some other stuffs actually so now so that is voting okay you can that is um that is power ups you can add any power power up that actually fits into what you want it for okay you can use any power up okay now let's go ahead to the next one which is automations automations we have rules we have buttons we have emails okay let's go to rules let's use rules let's see rules yeah this is automations okay so now now you have this particular this is rules okay there's a rule there initial let's take it off so you can always remove a rule you can also add a rule uh let's take off this rule okay okay so now let us add a rule create a rule so this is just the right top of what you can do and everything so then we create automation create automation then we are going to add a trigger add a trigger okay what do we want now card move when a card moves okay let's say when a card is added to list this is when a card is added to the board okay board then let us let us try this one when a card is added to the list list name let us no no let's say when a card is removed from the list when a card is moved out of the list which which list is that uh, let's use ideas okay by who by me anyone or by by anyone except me okay, let's say by anyone okay so when a card okay so by anyone let's add it we'll add it okay we we'll see it up here trigger when a card is moved out of lists by anyone except me no i don't want anyone except me i i i want i want to i want by anyone so by anyone ideas okay yeah, yeah done by when a card is moved when a card is added to the board no when a card is moved out of the list ideas okay ideas okay by anyone okay no by anyone i just want by anyone okay by anyone all right so i add it so now when a card is moved out of the list by anyone okay by anyone okay by anyone okay so what happens action what happens okay let us say checklist let us add so add an empty checklist by the name um um beauty beauty by the name beauty okay to the card okay add add an empty checklist by the name beauty to the card okay you do that to the card okay then what else do you do 
let me add another action again on on content content uh let's have it um on content let's have it set cast description okay description okay post the comments post the comments say hi hi digital people digital people hi digital people okay post the comments hi digital people so look at it now the breakdown look at it when when a card is moved out of the list ideas by anyone add an empty checklist named beauty to the card post a comment digital people then we can add many more actions as we want for the card we can add as many actions as possible then we save so once we save it this is it so this is, this is a breakdown when a card is moved out of the list ideas by anyone add an empty checklist named beauty to the card and post comments hi digital people so this is what happens when we move a card out of the checklist well i'm out, 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 out of um the the list ideas for example fine boy let's open fine boy here now you can see fine boy has no comment on it there's no comment on fine boy there is no um there is no checklist on fine boy and there's no other thing so we just have some little things now let's move fine boy out of out of this list now for those of you using using them um, android uh, mobile phones for your you know for your your stuff to move something out of from one list to the other you know on on the desktop we just take use the mouse move it out and drag it to where we want it to be now on your mobile phone, mobile phone just hold on it then you see move click on move okay then to where you want it to be let's say filming they say move it moves automatically to, to filming can you see that it moves to filming then you, you open it let's open it now let's see what happens to the card now you can see checklist has been added which is named beauty also a comment hi digital people has been added to it as well can you see that can you see that this is what we did can you see can you see so this is what this is the essence of the the uh what we call it the um the automations okay so we can do many things automation many things can be done in automation also in that same automation we can try to use um, buttons so what does buttons function okay so what is the function of buttons so what is the function of buttons so buttons we have here buttons okay then we have the what we can do the description and everything so we just say create buttons yeah create buttons there are so many several options there too so we can change the icon let's change the icon to maybe let's use them um, love love icon let's name it title let's name it love okay let's name it love okay then let's go ahead add an action move okay let's see move move to card okay let us let us use um let's use okay when we move the card to the top list list name move the card to the top list okay let's say let's say um let's say no no let, let's let's use let's say move the card to okay let's say move okay okay move when we move a card to the to the what now to the uh list bottom or top okay let's use top okay then list name let's use ideas ideas okay so okay ideas so it has entered so move the card to the bottom of lists ideas so i to be moved to the bottom of list ideas okay then we'll go ahead then we can also add them uh, probably um let's say members we can say okay okay join the card members should join the card okay or members member should leave the card yeah okay let's say leave the card leave the card okay leave the card okay okay leave the card okay let's have that one leave the card okay, members should leave the card okay then let's say contents um let's have a description description let's say who are you as the description of the card who are you we add it okay it's added already who are you leave the card okay okay then we can do many things anything that we want just to customize the something just to automate it is is an automation such that it will be automatic to be done automatically okay so we can do many other things um okay you can say dates dates okay set due dates you can set due dates move the due dates you can do anything right you can do anything so let's just save what we have already so we have saved it okay let us see the effect of it now so for example now let us see this card 
in ideas so ideas ideas car let's see fine girl let's see fine girl now this is fine girl um okay so this is fine girl card so now where is where is the where is the where is the uh, what do you call it where is the um the uh, what do you call it? the automation we did it was love look at it here Autom under auto automation you see love to activate it we have to click that love it will be activated automatically now look at it this this list now has no description now let's activate the love that we did automation activate success you see success is activated now look at it who are you as description it has come as who are you then this card now be moved to is it top is it top or bottom we put it i think it was top we said it will move to be, to be moved to the top of the list and we have who are you as the description you see now so let us go now so see now fine girl um what are you going to find girl okay it's bottom so that's it's now it's mainly the bottom of the list okay so this is automations it's just we can do anything to customize the list as we want as probably as we want it to be we can always use the autom autom um, automation then also we have the filters we have the filters this is filters filters to search for what we want specifically like we want no the ones that have no dates we can get it um the ones that are overdue we we'll get them um the ones that are due in the next uh, next day we we'll get them then we can also search by you know by specific name okay we want to search for fine boy fine boy so this is fine boy it has come this is here so fine boy so we'll click on it now we have so we have only fine boy so we can check for specific things as we want to okay so that is it on um and power ups automations and also um the filters now this would we are not done with the trello we, are, we still have some little things to do some little places to touch on trello but before then this will also usher us into um the app loom loom so the loom the video loom so now what i want to do now i want to do something every one of you i want you to go through the first video second video and third video set up your own workspace and do all this into this stage go ahead and do them now we are going to do a loom video you do the loom video now video record what you have done already with loom what you have done so far record it on your loom and everything all the steps i've taken show me everything that you can do on that on this um trello show me all that you can do so far on the trello then you're not going to send me a link send my dm you sent my dm a link that leads your video so i will click the link and go and watch your video and watch what you have done already then if there's any issues i will let you know if there if there's anything to learn as well i can also learn from you as well or i can learn from you or you can learn from me more thereabouts so just go ahead set up the video send me the link to my dm send the link to my dm i'll check it and let you know how far you've done if you have if you are doing well or not i will let you know okay please do that please do that very very important by tomorrow i will check i'll check only 20 only for 20 persons i'll just check then after 20 persons then we can move to the last part of this um trello so because the next thing we are doing now so it will be trello and loom so we are going to we're going to um zapia zapia some people have, some, people, some, some people are asking for hop spots so i don't know okay don't worry when we are done with uh, trello now by tomorrow we would know we would know if we should go to hop spot or to and uh, zapia or to any other app we shall know so please don't forget do this send me the link to my dm send the link to my dm i'm going to watch the videos you have done let me see what you have done so far what you can explore on trello and also what new things you've discovered probably i can learn from you okay then if you have issues let me know also if you have issues trying to set up the the loom trying to do the loom stuff the loom video let me know as well i can actually tell you what to do okay so i think we we'll have to end it here okay Thank you.